Hello students. Now in this session, I will explain question number five of exercise 2.4 chapter 2 linear equation in one variable. Now this is another very very important question of this exercise. So let me just read out the question first. This is this type of question is called age problem. Okay. Now question number five is Shobu's mother present age. Shobu's mother present age is six times Shobu's present age. So that means Shobu's mother present age is compared with Shobu's present age, isn't it? So for this, the first thing that you have to let is Shobu's present age, which we do not know. So solution. Shobu's present age would be Shobu's present age. You have to let this. Let Shobu's present age be x. Okay. Now, as you know the press Shobu's present age, now we can know. Uh, now we can estimate the Shobu's mother's present age also. Okay. Shobu's mother present age. That would be equals to what? 6 times Shobu's present age, isn't it? That means 6 times Shobu's present age. That is 6x. Okay? So these are the present age of Shobu's present age, of Shobu's and Shobu's mother. Okay? So again, I'm going to repeat this. As in the first sentence, it is said that Shobu's mother present age is 6 times, 6 times. Okay? That means... Shobu's mother's present age is six times Shobu's present age. Okay, so the first thing that we have done is we have let Shobu's present age as x. In that way, we have got Shobu's mother present age. That means six times Shobu's present age. That means six times, that is six into what is Shobu's present age? x. That is six x. Okay, now let's move on to the second sentence. Shobu's age five years from now. Now, this is a very important line. Okay, Shobu's age five years from now. So we'll write this. Shobu's age five years from now. Now suppose if Shobu's present age is X, then what would be Shobu's age after five years? So what we have to do? We have to add five with the present age of Shobu's. Okay, so this is the age that will be after five years. Of whose? Of Shobu's. Okay, so now we are aware, aware of Shobu's age five years from now. So let's move further. Will be one third of his mother's present age. Now we are, it is time to write the equation now. So according to the sentence, Shobu's age five years from now will be means equals to one third of one third of his mother's present age that is mother's present age okay mother's present age now we just put the values now Shobu's age five years from now is what x plus five so we'll put here x plus five then give equals to sign one third of means into what is mother's present age? Mother present age is what? 6x. So we'll write 6x. Okay. Now it is it can be easily reduced. That is 3 1s are 3, 3 2s are 6. So the next line we'll write x plus 5 is equals to 2x. Isn't it? Now we'll take this x towards right hand side. Okay. So it will look like 5 is equals to 2x minus x because what we do is we keep the variable in one side and we keep the constant terms in another side. Okay, so that is the reason we are taking uh, the variable terms towards right hand side this time. So what will the answer? We can write this equation in this format also that is 2x minus x equals to 5. In this way also we can write. So 2x minus x means x equals to 5. Fine. So what is x? x is 
Shoru's present tense. Okay, so now we are aware of Shoru's present tense. Now we can easily find Shoru's mother's present tense also, but we have to write it in sentence. Therefore, Shoru's present age is equals to five years, and Shoru's mother present age will be equals to 6 into 5 that is 30 years. So this is the final answer of question number 5. Okay students, so that's it for today. So in my next video, I will explain question number 6 and 7. Okay, thank you. God bless you all and stay blessed.